Hey everyone, today I'm going to go over mobile settings inside of ClickFunnels. I've had this question pop up many times, so I thought I'd do a quick uh, rundown on it. So I have an opt-in page that I have built, and uh, this is in desktop, uh, desktop mode. So over here on the left-hand side, it shows desktop and mobile. So you just want to make sure you optimize for your, your mobile, because 90% of the people looking on your stuff is going to look at it in the mobile view. So I've already set this one up for mobile, but if you notice, I click on mobile and it shows me um, everything that is on that opt-in page and resize the way I like it. So one thing you can do with this is let's just say that the picture on uh, the desktop, you know, this one right here, if you didn't want that to show up, you're, you're in the mobile here, you can go and you click on it. And then down here at the bottom, it'll say mobile only, desktop only, um, or you can hide it, you know, in general. But um, so we're going to put desktop only. So you notice it has a little red box around here and it says desktop only. So whenever you go back into the mobile, it's not there anymore. Now let's just say that oh you know what i'd rather have the picture there then you go back into the desktop view and you go into settings and then you hit all and then it's back for your mobile setting now whenever it comes to mobile you want to make sure that the text is it looks good because usually whenever you have something we already have this set up but let's just show you sometimes it can be like this and then it's drug out and you don't want to do that so you want to make sure that it is sized properly and you just play with it until you like what you see um so 32 is what i had this set up at so i'll put this back at 32 because it looks a lot better um, then from here i will go and i will look at it and see if it's something that i want to change if that's the case then you go in and make sure that you're only doing the mobile size because if you mess with the other part, it's not going to matter what the mobile shows. And then also, um, down here, just any of your stuff, if it needs to be resized, click on it, resize it. Because it does, I mean, it could look pretty bad if it's not uh, resized for your mobile screens. Because you definitely don't want something like this happening. You don't want anything like this going on. Or you don't want to leave one word stranded on a line. Now we do have a backup button now that's in beta feature. So if you don't have this, I'll do a video showing everybody how to do it. But you just hit the back button and it puts it back to the way it was. So this is your mobile view and then this is your desktop view. If you need to move anything, change anything, you know, desktop's easy. Um, again, you can click on an image and you can put mobile only desktop only or you can hide it completely if you decide you don't want it so if you have any other questions please let me know be sure to make to hit the save button in the upper right hand corner because any changes that you made will not save and then you will um, have to do it all over again i will see you on the next video